Good morning, everyone. Good morning. I uh, hope you had a great weekend. We had an awesome weekend. Yeah, great weekend. Um, we spent a lot of time with friends this weekend. Yes, we did. And um, I have been directing a play. I finished that Friday night. We were with friends. Um, I was with my cast Friday and then friends Saturday and friends Sunday. And that really got me to thinking about the importance of our environment. Mm -hmm. The people that we, that you, us, we spent we choose to spend time with. So I always ask the question, who you allow to influence you, who you allow to influence you. Yeah. Who, what people in your life do you allow to inform your choices? Yep. And are they informing you to make progress with your goals or they are, or are they informing you to take a break and relax? So I had asked George today, what do you want to talk about? And I said, let's talk about the people that we hang out with. And are they encouraging yep. you in, um, are you, first of all, are you able to even share what you'd love to see happen in your life? And do they respond with, hey, that's awesome. Right. You know, and then maybe even give you some ideas on how to do it. Right. Right. You know? Uh, yeah. I mean, we're pretty much, our friends are all entrepreneurs yeah. who have started businesses yeah, but they're also, mm -hmm. um, the majority of them are people with a personal faith as well. Absolutely. And their faith informs their entrepreneurial, that's a hard one to say, choices. Right. Yeah, yeah. And so, you know, it it, it sounds so mean. I know Shalene says this a lot, but, uh, and maybe she didn't say this, but she repeated it, but you are the sum of like the eight people that you hang around. You know, and that can sound really rude and judgmental. Um, but you know what? Only you need to know that you're thinking about that right now. <laughs> so take inventory of your environment and ask yourself, wow, is this propelling me forward or is this helping me to remain stuck? Yep. So anything you'd like to add to that? No, I think it's great. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, there are those people in your life who are going to be more, um, it's going to be more of a give than a take. Uh, and there are going to be seasons of that, and that's okay. Mm -hmm. um, because I think that's what we're called to in our faith, is to is to minister and to share, mm -hmm. bear each other's burdens. Right. Um, but there's also a sense of mutual bearing each other's burdens. And so um, I think you need to surround yourself with people where... Uh, you know, it's a mutual bearing of burdens. Yeah, it is a mutual bearing of burdens, and we really feel like we have that. So right. um, take some stock. Sit down and take some inventory. And for those people who really are encouraging you, you to move forward, thank them. Absolutely. Thank them and say thank you so mm -hmm. much because <clears throat> I need that support. And that's what we try to do in our challenge groups, and that's what we do for each other. Absolutely. So, yep. So anyway, even during a workout when my husband says, leave me alone. Which happened today. <laughs> I can only handle so many instructors at one time. Woo! Yeah, that and was... Wes Mill was my instructor. <laughs> right. Okay, guys. Have a great day. Take inventory and fight for a circle that will encourage you to move forward and Absolutely. will challenge you to yes. move forward. Take care. Bye. Yeah, bye.